What's up, Cast King fans? I'm out here with the old White Max, giving it a little run during my uh, what I like to call my Bass Day Repast, which is basically lunchtime, trying to get a little bit of tossing in during my lunchtime. But I am on the Illinois River on a backwash off of what's called Mendenhall Road. And as you can see, this is a lovely little place to come. It's uh, one of the little backwashes that I get to come to when I'm at my airport facility, which is uh, one of the funner little places to sneak off to when you have the time. So I happen to get out done there at noon and, well, not noon, but close to it, and snuck off down here to do a little bit of fishing. So nothing's biting right now and right now unfortunately this area is really heavy with carp uh happens this time of the year a lot along this river in the backwashes if i had some corn uh <laughs> bait i'd be doing pretty good but it is what it is so you know you take the good with the bad but i wanted you to be able to see that how pretty it is back there and it's really calm and just kind of kind of breaks up the day and it's really uh that's what fishing does for me. It's calming when you've had a crazy day and the morning's already been nuts at work. So I just love to come down here and look around and just, it's peaceful. You know, there's never anybody really down here. Most of them go a little bit further down the road. There's a launch ramp that puts you right on the channel of the Illinois River. And that's a section of the river that moves pretty quickly. So you get uh, a lot more people tend to do the catfishing down there along the river so i sneak back here to these little areas where you can't get bass i've caught several bass back here before but you know they're far and few between at times uh depends on the time of the year and i didn't care i know this is a hard time of the year to find bass down here but really it was all about just a little serenity from the crazy morning more than anything and yeah like i said anytime you're using the cast king gear you don't have to fight the gear and that's huge to me you know i can come out here and just have a peaceful 45 minutes 30 minutes whatever you know and not have to fight the gear and it just uh makes it so nice i'm just i'm so much more relaxed now i've been out here about 20 minutes chucking some stuff out here into the water trying to make something happen but i'm seeing rollers everywhere and it's all carp but still we got the old uh we got the old uh grass snagger right there we've got a lipless on so with the white max trying to see if we can't snag a carp uh it'd be accidental of course but you never know so yeah i just wanted to get on here and let everybody know i'm out again at lunchtime and got the old white max going i love these lunchtime day getaways they're just a lot of fun and calming that's the main reason I do them is, well, one, I'm just so addicted to fish and I can't stay away from it. But uh, they are calming. They do break up the day and they make it feel, I mean, I'm out here. I've had a crazy morning and I've only been out here probably about 20, 25 minutes, something like that, that I've actually been fishing. And I mean, it doesn't even feel like I've been at work. It's just, it's really calming. And it's thanks to Cast King for being able to make that an affordable thing to do, you know. It's just kind of neat. So... I'm going to let everybody go on that note, you know. It's just, enjoy it, guys. You know, even if you can only get out for 20, 25 minutes over a lunch and you've got a, a body of water near you, do yourself a favor and just go out and do it, you know. You're not trying to win a tournament or anything, but every time you put the line in the water, you know, you're learning something and you're practicing. So practice a technique or, you know, there's been times I've gone down to the river at my marina that'll be opening up october 1st back to fishing again and uh, i'll just practice skipping under the docks you know 20 30 minutes worth of practicing skipping so i mean you can practice a technique something to get you you know break up your day and get out there on the water and just forget about things and uh, and learn a technique you know if you want to if you want to make it something learn a technique you know practice something you know, it's always something that you can do while you're out there and not make it a waste. which I mean, I don't think it's ever a waste when you're out there, but if you're practicing a technique, you're really, you know, practice your, your aiming with your bait casters and stuff. It's a really good way to go. So I'm going to let you guys go. I hope you guys are having a great day and I hope a lot of you are being able to find time to sneak a fish here, a fishing session in here and there. Um, other than that, guys, tight lines and keep it cast keen, guys. See you guys later.